Hi everyone, it's Tamara. This workout segment is all about shaping and toning your booty. So make sure you have some free space available, clear any trip hazards out of your way and let's get started. This exercise is traditional glutes bridge. Lying in supine position with knees bent and feet on the floor. Lift up squeezing your glutes until your hips reach the top. Shoulders grounded and arms beside you for support. Your turn. This exercise is marching from glutes bridge, lying in supine position with knees bent and feet on the floor. Lift up, squeezing your glutes until your hips reach the top. Tuck your knees to your chest alternately, maintain your hip height. Your turn. This exercise is a single legs glute bridge. Lying in supine position with knees bent and feet from the floor. Point one foot straight up with flexed heel and straight knee. Lift up, squeezing your glutes until your hips reach the top. Your turn. This exercise is calves raise from glutes bridge. Lying in supine position and lifting into a glutes bridge, start your calves raise from here without dropping your hips. A little pause at the top of the calves raise will enhance the exercise. Give it a go.
This exercise is inward stiff leg drop from four points. Extend your kicking leg straight with pointy toes. Start your kicking leg lifted right to the top. Drop your leg inwards nice and straight past your base foot. Give it a go. This exercise is stiff leg high pulses from four points. Extend your kicking leg straight with heel flexed, lifting straight up and pulsing at the top. Keep your glutes contraction without swinging through your hips. Your turn. This exercise is a traditional donkey kick from four points. Kicking straight up with your knee bent and squeezing your glutes. Flex your foot as though you're trying to leave your footprint on the ceiling. Keep your upper body stationary throughout the exercise. Give it a go.
This exercise is rainbow leg drop from four points position. Extend your kicking leg straight with pointy toes, drawing semicircles with your toes from outside to inside. Try to lift as high as you can and squeeze your butt mid repetition. Your turn. This exercise is a leg curl from four points. Extend your kicking leg straight with heel flex, lifting your leg straight up till you get right to the top. Leg curl without allowing movement in your knee. This exercise is side leg raise pulses. Lie side on and set up a sturdy base using your bottom leg. Lift into side leg raise with square hips and a straight leg. Work pulses at the top, allowing only a quarter of the leg raise motion. Your turn.
Hi everyone, this workout segment is all about combining strength exercises with cardio exercises to create the ultimate fat shredding high intensity interval workout. All you need is some clear space around you as well as a weight plate to complete the workout. You can train with your workout buddy by alternating exercises or you can train by yourself. We hope you enjoy this workout. This superset is a combination of Zerka squats and jumping jacks. So start your Zerka squats with your feet parallel at shoulder width, your shin bones nice and vertical, and we're holding the plate nice and tight against our body. Uh, drop nice and deep into those squats until it's time to change and get into your jumping jacks. For the jumping jacks, try to stay nice and light on the ball of your foot to avoid any impact on your knees. Your turn to try this one.
we're combining barbarian squats with fast feet for this exercise. So the barbarian squat starts much like an upright pickup where you take the plate all the way down and it narrowly misses the floor. And then we're going to pull it right up and go into an overhead tricep extension with it and then work our way back down. Now make sure you've got comfortable footing. So you want your feet to be at shoulder width or you can have it marginally wider if you like and just keep a good pace through this exercise. Now, we're going to switch it up and get into some fast feet for your cardio exercise. So nice and light on the ball of your foot and just a matter of keeping the pace up throughout the set until it's time to change over. Your turn to try this one. Yeah.
Let's take a quick rest break. If you have your water bottle with you, now's a great time to take a sip and replenish. Use your rest break to take some deep breaths and get your breathing pattern back under control. Nice tough combination for this exercise guys. We're going to combine biceps curls with plyometric squats for this exercise. So starting with your bicep curls, just make sure your elbows are tucked in by your ribs and they're staying nice and stationary. Full range of movement without flicking the wrist, so making sure the wrist's staying um, perpendicular to your arm throughout the exercise. And then when we work the plyometric squats, make sure you're jumping up and then you're coming down, landing, and you continue to work your way down. We don't want the sudden jolt in the knees by stopping at the end of the jump. The only point where you stop will be at the bottom of the squat and we're going to keep moving. This one's really going to get your heart rate up. Your turn to try this combination.
working a combination of snatch squats and uppercuts for this one. So what you want to do with your snatch squats, get your plate right over your head and try and keep your arms fairly well extended, dropping down into nice controlled squats for this one. So you can see my feet are at shoulder width, um, knees are right on top of it, so I've got parallel uh, shin bones. And then getting all the way down and picking it all the way back up as well. For the cardio exercise, we're just going to hit some uppercuts. So make sure you've got good hips movement and pivot of the foot for this one. And just keep the pace up until it's time to go back into those squats. Your turn to try it.
Well done for getting through this challenging workout. Please take a few minutes to stretch and cool your body down before finishing. Comment and let us know what you thought of the workout and remember to subscribe for your daily workout fix.